um, doing a video today on wash and go. I was so excited. This is a milestone um, for me in my natural hair journey. I finally learned how to master the wash and go on type four hair. So I'm super duper excited. Lately I have been rocking wash and goes and that's it. <laughs> Just because I love them, they're simple and very easy to do now that I know how to do them. So I wanted to share what I do with you guys. So if you're out there and you have type four hair and you're still trying to figure out what to do, um, products to use, things like that. Hopefully my example will help you and you'll be able to do wash and goes as well. Um, I will say the products that I use, I like them because they work on my hair. However, you, I want you to try your own leave-in conditioner that you like, oil that you like, and your gel that you like. So, without further ado, this is how I get my lash and go. <laughs> so, I am starting off on freshly washed hair and I am putting in a part because that's how I want my hair to be. And I'm starting off by small sections, add, adding um, the leave-in conditioner. The oil. And you add gel. After adding the gel, I take my dimming brush and I just brush my hair. That way I can get all the tangles out. And you just continue the same method until your total head is done. So I decided to do majority of mine off camera just because I didn't want to bore you. <laughs> but this is what my hair looks like before it dries. I am going to do this method that I saw on YouTube by another vlogger and it's sitting under the dryer. The purpose of using this is to um, Limit, eliminate shrinkage, but also have your wash and go ready. So I'm gonna take this hooded dryer that I have and I'm gonna sit under here for at least 60 minutes. And this is my final product. My curls are popping. So at the end, I'm just make sure my edge is uh, slayed and laid and I am using my favorite edge control with Murray's Edge Wax. 